One particular disease of the red blood cells is sickle cell anemia, and we're going to talk about this in depth a little because we are going to see this a lot in our hospital systems today. Sickle cell disease is a mutation in the beta change chains of hemoglobin, and um, what happens is that the, uh, the actual shape of the um, red blood cell changes and, and becomes sickled and creates a disease process that leads to um, a chronic hemolytic anemia and blood vessel occlusion for the patient. The picture here is, um, is to show you where the um, blood vessel occlusion generally takes place. Um, and what kinds of signs and symptoms that you might actually see with someone in sickle cell disease. Um, strokes, blindness, um, pulmonary emboli, those all make sense to us, but some of the more subtle um, uh, occlusion places are the um, avascular necrosis of the femoral head, um, osteomyelitis, um, the spleen atrophies. Uh, so, so these people um, have a variety of chronic disease processes that need to be managed throughout their lifetime. Problems caused by the sickled cell uh, include the blocking of capillaries and this blocking of capillaries causes acute pain. In fact, it, this acute pain is what brings people in and is the major thing that we do as a nurse to care for these patients is take care of the pain. Um, when, uh, when the sickling becomes um, an embolus or a, a, a thrombus, um, these, these thrombi can cause infarctions um, to the liver, spleen, heart, kidneys, eyes, and bones, as we talked about. Um, these people are also, because the sickled cells um, are more likely to be destroyed, are at risk for jaundice. We diagnose this um, disease in infancy. And um, early prophylactic, prophylactic treatment with antibiotics to prevent infection. Um, is what we do while they're in the hospital. The other major thing that we do while they're in the hospital is pain management. Um, our goal um, is to support the um, organ function while they're in the hospital, um, manage their pain, and we support organ function by um, doing blood transfusions as ne necessary. Um, minimally, we um, hydrate to get rid of that polycythemia that's going on, the thickness of the blood, um, and we manage the pain. 